Hi, my name's Amari Mack, and today we'll talk about how to find the area of a non-rectangular parallelogram. First, let's look at a rectangular parallelogram. Now, one thing we see with rectangles is that the width and the length are perpendicular to each other. So, the area for a rectangle is length times width. Uh, for example, if we had a 3 for a length and a width of 2, we would get 3 times 2, which is 6. But what happens if we have a parallelogram? We have sides and bases. Let's say we have side 1, side, and we can actually call that side 1 since they're equal, and we can call the bases equal base 1 and base 1. Unfortunately, since this is not a 90 degree angle, I cannot just multiply side 1 by base 1 to get the area. But we need a 90 degree angle, so what we do is we go from the corner of base 1 and go straight down to make our 90 degree angle. And this will be the height. So then, we're going to do for area, base or base 1 times the height. So if you have a non-rectangular parallelogram, do the base times the height, which goes from the corner of the top base down directly to the other base. Uh, for example, let's say the height was 3 and base 1 was 4. Uh, we would get 4 times 3, which is 12 square units. So there you have it. That's how you find the area of a parallelogram, which is non-rectangular. Thanks for watching.